Hi, this is Pete Thayer. In this video, we're going to see how to take a quiz using version 7. There are over 700 quizzes built into this program, and you can make your own quizzes. We have created four different ways for you to quiz yourself on the birds. This is a multiple choice quiz. This is the hardest type of quiz. The fill in the blank quiz requires you to type in the bird's name. With the flashcard quizzes, you try to guess the bird's name as soon as you see the picture. The name appears after a few seconds. Pick one quizzes are my favorite. We give you the name of the bird and you have to click on the correct photo. The Windows version 7 even lets you import your own photos and create quizzes on things like butterflies. It's easy to take a quiz. Just click on the quizzes icon in the menu bar, select the quiz you want, select the type of quiz you want to take, fine tune the quiz if desired, and then take the quiz. When you click the quiz icon, this is the page you see. First, select one of the five tabs across the top. Then, expand the list of categories below to see the names of the actual quizzes that you can take. Here we have expanded the All in the Family category so we can see the quizzes that are available to us. In Windows computers, you click the plus sign in front of a category name to expand the list. And in Mac computers, click the triangle in front of the category name. In version 7, there are hundreds and hundreds of quizzes that we have created for you. Just expand the category name and click on the quiz that you would like to take. You can even click the radio button to arrange all the quizzes in alphabetical order. Most of the quizzes are found under the Favorite Quizzes tab. But there are others you can select. Click Location and you can select any state or province or even a combination. When you click on Bird Groups at the top, you can see all the orders of birds. Click on the box you'd like to take a quiz on. Or expand the list to take a quiz on families or even genus. When you click on the Custom Lists tab, you can select one of the custom lists included in version 7, or you can select a custom list you created, or you can select a custom list you downloaded from the Thayer Birding Software website. In the Windows version of our software, you are able to create quizzes on virtually anything. I've imported pictures of butterflies, pictures of birds from many different countries, and created a variety of quizzes for my overseas birding trips. To take a quiz, just click on the name of the quiz and click Next. Then select one of the four quiz types and click Run Quiz. To fine-tune the quiz, click Next. Each of the four quiz types has their own setup screen that lets you fine-tune your quiz. You can set the difficulty level, select the media to be displayed, and much more. Each of these setup pages carries over to a second screen that gives you even more choices. If you take a fill-in-the-blank quiz, be sure you set the difficulty level to something appropriate. Flashcard quizzes are great for large groups. You can set the timer to decide how long to display a photo. You can select the picture type, showing the male, female, or random photos. And if you're a masochist, you can just have the sound play with no picture at all. Flashcard quizzes are ideal for places like retail stores, bird conventions, or a nature center. Be sure to set the quiz to loop so it will play over and over again. We've just seen how to fine-tune each quiz. Now let's do a review of the four major quiz types. Multiple choice quizzes show you the names of five birds and you have to decide which one is pictured. With a fill-in-the-blank quiz, you actually type in the name of the bird. When you're done, click the Answer button. A flashcard quiz will show you a new photo every few seconds. It will also display the bird's name for a second or two before moving on to the next bird. 
The Pick One Quiz is a great learning tool. We show you the name of one bird and you have to click on the correct photo. But you can also click on the Show Names box and see the names of all four birds currently being displayed. If you're a new birder or you're going to visit a new part of the country, this is a great way to learn about all the birds of that area. If you do a great job on any quiz, you can add your name to the Hall of Fame. Just click Tools in the menu bar, then click Options, then click the Quiz tab to enable the Hall of Fame for top scorers. If you have the Hall of Fame feature turned on, you will see a box where you can type in your name. Heck, you might even get an applause. The quizzes are by far the most popular part of our software. You can take four types of quizzes on hundreds and hundreds of different quizzes we have created or make your own quiz using custom lists.